Exactly. Thanks, John. It's pretty common that dogs should not eat chocolate. We all know that. But turns out there are a lot of other common foods and items that can also be very dangerous or even deadly for your pets. Joining us this morning is emergency veterinarian, Dr. Heather Lenzer. She's joining us this morning. She is with the American Animal Hospital Association. Great to have you here. Thank you for having me. And you're actually in town because you're getting a big award today. Is I that right? Have, Tell I me about have, that. I uh, got an excellence in journalism award, actually, nice. um, from the American Pet Products Association. So I'll be at Global Pet Expo, which is a blast. Right. Lots of great yeah. things there. Um, but really, I'm just so honored to be able to get the word out about how to take care of our pets. Yeah, it's so important because mm -hmm. we love our pets. Sometimes we, I think we overlove them, right? We're like, yeah. we give them little treats off the table or we give them things maybe that we eat that really aren't safe for them. Exactly. Right? And I actually posted on Facebook today on the American Animal Hospital Association's page a huge list of how to poison proof your home for pets. Okay. A lot of things on there that people don't realize. Okay. And so the biggest culprit actually often is our purses. Right. Yeah, because we leave them on the ground and they put their little noses in there yes. and they grab stuff out of there, right? And we're both moms, so yeah. we're, we're prepared. It's always good to have food around for our kids. So we can put things in our purses that are actually toxic to dogs. Oh, gosh. Grapes and raisins, both of those actually can cause kidney failure in dogs. And the, the scary thing about that from a veterinarian standpoint is we don't know what the dose is. Meaning, your wine reiner could four grapes yeah. and that could put him into kidney failure. You did mention the chocolate. Chocolate, right. Keynote here is the darker the chocolate, the more toxic it is to the right. smaller dogs. Don't worry about white chocolate, but the really nice stuff, toxic. Our dog ate an entire bag of uh, Halloween Snickers one time. I bet that turned out okay. It, well, right? it, we had a lot of wrappers all over the floor for right. a while, which was gross, but the doctor said because it's the milk chocolate and because exactly. of all the other stuff that's in there, it was ended up being okay. So, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Good to so know. So now we've got, we have, again, things in our purse, mm -hmm. sugar-free gum. So we all love these things. They're great products for us, but they contain a substance called xylitol. It starts with an X, and that can cause liver failure, low blood sugar, and seizures in dogs. Wow. And it doesn't take very much. Okay. And again, mentioning the raisins, because yeah. we have those in our purse. And then all of our pain medicines. Mm. It doesn't take, it can take one or two of certain pain medicines, one or two pills, to kill a medium-sized dog. Oh, gosh. So okay. keep these away. Keep your purse up and away. All righty. Now, it's St. Patrick's Day, and everybody's getting prepared right now. So if you have your decorations out, look and make sure there's nothing scary like these. Cats and dogs like to chew and swallow things that look like strings. Yeah. And these will actually tie intestines up in knots. Okay. And then we have an emergency surgery. Yeah, that's not good. Glow sticks, believe it or not, cats love to chew on them. And if they bite into them, it's like us eating a jalapeno pepper. It burns their mouth. Oh, boy. Shamrock plants are adorable. They are leaf cute. Clover. Yeah. Um, Non-toxic for leprechauns. But <laughs> if our dogs and cats get into these, they can have a lot of vomiting, diarrhea, and again, kidney failure. Okay. So keep that up as well. And then beer. Oddly enough, dogs do like to drink beer. Huh. So um, they can get alcohol poisoning just like we can. So okay. keep beer bottles and beer mugs away. And don't feed your dog beer. Don't think it's you're being fun. funny. It's not yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah. And no. then soda bread, right? Yeah. Uh, who doesn't love soda bread? But again, culprit there, raisins. Okay. And it doesn't take much to kill a dog. All right. How can our viewers find you, doctor? Go to aha.org. So A-A-H-A dot org. Okay. And I'm on there. And there's also a lot of great information that pet owners need to know. All right. Big award so today. It's so nice to have you with us this morning. All right. 946 right now.